is Sammy J and Randy with the entertainment news. Hello. Hello. How are mm. you, Randy? Mm, I'm good, thanks. How are you? I'm very well, thank you for asking. <laughs> Kylie Minogue rumoured to be having Botox injections. Kylie said the accusations were funny, surprising, sad, shocking and worrying. And she'll get back to us all with those facial expressions in a few months' time. <laughs> Avril Lavigne damages her beautiful face in a bar fight. Good on her. Yeah, it's been ages since she had a hit. <laughs> Bunch of haters. <clears throat> Michael Jackson's Dr Conrad Murray is found guilty of manslaughter. Jackson's family is said to be over the moonwalk. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, good night. <laughs> I'm not over the moonwalk. Check it out. <laughs> Mildly ambivalent, but I think it's pretty cool. It's like Pac-Man on acid. <laughs> The European MTV Awards are interrupted by Streaker. No one batted an eyelid. There'd been enough cocks on stage already. Mm. <laughs> the name of the new James Bond film is revealed. It's called Skyfall, which is much better than the original title, Quantum of Solace 2, a solace more quanti. <laughs> what? A solace more quanti. <laughs> Did you get any sleep last night? Not a wink. <laughs> Paul Hogan has demanded the Australian tax office pay him $10 million for damaging his spotless reputation. It's the same amount of money he got for doing that pretending to be gay movie with Michael Caton. Mm. Spotless, spotless reputation. <laughs> Channel 7 acts as wild boys after it gets ratings of only one million per episode. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? Well, it's just that if we rated one million per episode, we'd be regarded as Network 10's saviour. Shut up! Come on! You're on thin ice. We've only got two weeks left. What's the worst they can do? That's right, Murdoch, Packer, Reinhardt. I'll take you. I'll take you. You don't even know what I really look like. Yeah. I don't know what I look like. <laughs> You'll just get caught up in the crossfire. <laughs> Sorry, boss. <clears throat> and finally, Susan Boyle hits town and he's photographed amongst our delightful flora and fauna. And? What? Tell him what you did. Now's not the time. Okay, Sammy's a huge Boyle fan, right? Well, it's not huge. He, you've got a shrine. It's not a shrine, it's a dedication wall. Anyway, <laughs> he hears she's doing this photo shoot in the bush somewhere, but there's heaps of security, right? So he dressed up as a wattle tree. It wasn't a wattle, it was a Grevillea bank side. Whatever. Not a dick. Anyway, so Boyle rocks up, right? Sammy can't contain himself, shakes pollen all over her face. She has an allergic reaction, gets rushed to hospital. And that's where the story ends. Bullshit! <laughs> Sammy follows the ambulance, sneaks into the hospital, disguises himself as a nurse and spends two hours skulking around the ward trying to catch a glimpse of her until security finally kicked him out on his ass. And what have you got to show for it? Cha-ching. <laughs> and that's the entertainment news!